Today, we're gonna to build some bookshelves. A few weeks ago, we signed a lease on the sweet office space downtown, Enumclaw, and we have been working on getting this space ready for Sarah's business, um, and then also renting some office space to some of her friends in the back. And all of my junk. Why is there so much junk? So today we got a shipment in of these five shelf bookcases from Walmart in Canyon Walnut. Um, so we're gonna build them. See how long it takes. So I just got done putting together a bunch of stuff from Ikea and the cool part about Ikea is they give you the little tool that you need to put together pretty much everything. But not with this. Thankfully though, I brought this. Before starting, Read each step carefully before starting. It's very important that each step of the instruction is performed in the correct order. If these steps are not followed in sequence, blah, 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 okay, parts, whatever. Okay, step one, here we go. You gotta get these things seated in there good, otherwise it won't, you know, won't go. So putting together this kind of furniture, I learned something kind of cool about these cam lock systems. So you screw this into one piece of wood, you set this in another piece of wood, and then they kind of interlock together like this. So that when you tighten this part right here, it pulls the two pieces together and gets this nice, good fit. All right, so we've got the screw here, and then we're going to put the locking piece here like this. I mean, we'd all agree that safety is important, right? I mean, we don't want to have anything, anybody hurt by what we do. So they give you these little things here that uh, we are going to screw into the top piece. And then this piece will go into the wall. And then that way, if this bookshelf ever tips, it'll catch that wall and it won't crush somebody. Big time importance. So I've heard the phrase, when the only tool you have a, is a hammer, every problem is a nail. Well, what happens when you have a nail, but you don't have a hammer and all you have is a doorknob? Okay, that wasn't good. All right, so we've pretty much got all of the hardware installed, and now it's time to put these panels together. This part's kind of scary. All right, here we go. Caution, failure to follow this step carefully could result in damage to the unit Two people are required to complete this step correctly? We'll just see about that. I mean, I get it. Like, you, sometimes it's better to have two people do something, but you don't always have that luxury. So here we go. So maybe two people would have been good because right here I kind of busted through the uh, the side, but um, yeah. Nailed it. I should have said screwed it, but yeah, you get it. I didn't need two people. Now the smart way to build this now would be to build it on the floor and then bring it up, but why? Why? Is this the right thing though? No. Yeah. 
Okay, I need to uh, put some. The keys just go nice. At the bottom panel here, I'm just gonna wiggle this in. Maybe, almost, you know. All right, so it's really important to protect your floors because you spent a bunch of money on them, right? So we've got these little teeny sharp little things we're gonna hammer into the bottom so that it protects the floor. But again, if you don't have a trusty hammer, the doorknob will do just fine. All right, so if you think at this point, well, he's almost done, but there's no back plate to this thing. Well, that's what I thought too. And I almost threw these things away until I opened them up and realized, oh, that matches. So we're gonna nail these things on. But again, we don't have a hammer, so you know what we're gonna use. Okay, so this step's taking a lot longer than I thought it was going to, and it's largely because I don't have a hammer. So I'm gonna go borrow one. Well, good news, we got a hammer. So this is gonna go by a lot faster. All right, so now it's time to stand this thing up, put some pins in it and set them shelves down. Now I have absolutely no idea where Sarah's gonna want these shelves, but the beauty of it, they're adjustable. I'm just gonna put these little guys in and away we go. All right, there you have it. We are done. Bookcase is in. Now we just gotta secure to the wall and we're done. Well, because we have a whole other one to make. <laughs>